Here's how I make this chromatic aberration effect here in After Effects. Create a new composition, rename it RGB, and I'm gonna go with 1080p, 30 frames per second, 6 seconds, click OK. And I'm gonna drag and drop the video that I'm gonna use, press the letter S, I'm gonna scale it down with 50, right click on the video, click on Pre Comp, rename it as Footage, and select Move All Attributes into the new composition, click OK. Let's go to Effects and Presets, type in Shift Channel, and drag and drop the shift channels on the footage. Let's select the layer, press Ctrl D two times to duplicate. Now I'm gonna go with the top layer, and let's go and turn off the blue, turn off, turn off the red. Let's go to the second layer. Here we're gonna turn off the green, turn off the blue, and about least we're gonna go to the last footage layer. And here we're gonna turn off the red and turn off the green as well. So this is how it should look. I'm going to select all three layers and we're going to need to go to the blend mode but as you can see we don't have it here so we're going to go here to the toggle switch click on it and this way it's going to appear let's go to the blend mode and change it to screen i'm also going to rename the layers this is going to be green red and blue now let's select the green layer and press and hold shift and press the up arrow twice now i'm going to select the red layer press and hold shift and press the left arrow twice and now at least I'm gonna select the blue layer, press and hold shift, and press the right arrow twice. It looks a little bit more exaggerated, but we're gonna fix that. Let's select all three layers, press the letter P for position, press and hold Alt, click on the stopwatch of the position, and I'm gonna type in wiggle 515. I'm gonna press Ctrl A, Ctrl C, click somewhere here, and it's going to wiggle like that. And I'm also gonna do the same thing with the red and the blue, just copy paste the expression so it's gonna look something like this. I'm gonna collapse these layers and I'm also gonna make a new adjustment layer. Let's go to effects and presets, search for posterize time. Drag and drop on the adjustment layer and I'm gonna decrease it with uh, 14. I'm also gonna go to effects and presets, type in noise and drag and drop under the posterize. I'm gonna increase it to 20. And yeah, let's see what we got. And it's gonna make this shaky chromatic aberration. And this is how I make this chromatic aberration here in After Effects. Thanks for watching.